Hey guys, thanks for joining me today. I wanted to do a review and demo of a really cool product that I was um, sent. This is the Numi Titan 3. This is a wand for your hair and you guys always ask me how I do my hair and what I do and I've been using the Enzo Milano for the longest time and this is basically the same thing but you guys will get it a lot cheaper if you use um, the discount code and stuff that I will provide for you guys. So I have a tutorial showing you guys how to use this which you will see a little bit later on in the video. It is super super easy. So what this is, is this is the wand that you get. This barrel right here is interchangeable. I have three barrels. This is the one inch that I've used currently to do my hair, which you guys will see how to do that in a second. You also have a one and a half inch right here. And it also comes with a half inch one. So if you guys are familiar with wands, I'm sure you will like this. It's very, very similar to the Enzo Milano, pretty much the exact same thing. So what this is over here is that it has this matte black um, casing over here. It, it says off right now, obviously, because it is off. You turn it on by pressing the on-off button. You'll hold it down. You can move up or down the temperature. The highest is 180 degrees Celsius. and or, I mean 180 degrees Fahrenheit. Sorry, Celsius would be crazy. And then um, you'll see these two buttons up here on the sides. You press that to remove the barrels. So you hold it down, and you just pull on the actual barrel. So you press this down, you pull an actual barrel, and you will pull out this um, particular barrel, and you can put in new ones. The problem that I ran into with this um, is that it was kind of hard to change out the barrels. Pressing this down and pulling it out is not as easy as it looks. So I did have to have help with that too, with somebody holding this part while I pulled the other part to get that off. So that wasn't fun, and I did reach out to um, the owner, and they did tell me that basically they are switching out, or they are changing the technology on these ones completely. So it'll be a whole new product very soon. In which case, if you guys want to order this online, you should um, instead go for the Magic Wand, which is the same thing without interchangeable barrels. So it is basically this exact same thing, but you only get one barrel, um, not three. But if you do want to get uh, the Titan 3 set, that is also on their website, which is uh, numiproducts.com. And I love this. It is high heat. And I think that helps with my particular um, type of hair. I have very, very thick hair. And... For me, it's only wands that end up working. Normal curling irons just don't hold a curl the same way as a wand does. And right now, I kind of curled it more than I usually would just to show you guys how it looks like this. And then by pulling my hands through my hair, it'll become a lot looser. And I just love, like, the nice, like, sexy beach waves that it gives. It is so natural, but it's something that's so pretty. It almost doesn't even look like you've really put that much effort into it. And for me, it takes me 12 minutes to do my entire head with this. So the one inch is my favorite. This is the one that also is the size that I use in my Enzo Milano. I just like that type of curl. The one and a half inch I feel like doesn't hold a curl as much as um, I like it to. Maybe it's just too loose for my thickness of hair. And then obviously the half inch would be like ringlet curls. But even that would look more natural than a curling iron would. Um, so with this, I really like the way that it looks. I think it's really nice and simple. The black casing is obviously something that I've always really liked. I kind of wish this was in black as well just to make it look a little bit sleeker, but what I do like about this is that it's very, very lightweight. If you hold other wands, you'll notice they're much heavier. So I don't know what's different about this one, but it's a lot less um, heavy, which is nice to travel with. And my favorite part about this is that it's got a swivel cord, and the cord is very, very long. I don't know how many feet, but it's a lot longer than um, most curling irons, most hair dryers, any of that kind of stuff. And you might think that's like a very, very small thing, but I learned to appreciate that even more when I'm on vacation because you don't always have the, um, your desired space. You don't have just a lot of room in general to work with if you're in a hotel room and stuff like that and other people are there. And so having a long cord and a swivel cord really helps because you can work in smaller areas and still make it functional by having these extra things um, with your products. So it really does help. Um, so for you guys, we are doing a giveaway, which is going to end in two weeks from when I put up this video. So I want you guys to post down below telling me why you guys want this product. And what we will be sending you is not the Titan 3. We're going to be sending you the Magic Wands. And I'm going to do two winners with one barrel size each. So you guys, um, I'm going to pick two people who are going to win just awesome, not just one. And you guys can pick what barrel size you would like, and we will send that to I you. I just want to pick a winner who I think really deserves it. So I want to hear why you want it, why you think it'll help you. It doesn't have to be something crazy like, oh, I have this, you know, issue and this is why I want it. But you could just want it because you want it. And that is totally fine. I have not a problem with that at all. So just write down below in the comment section why you guys want it, why you think you deserve it. Um, please, please be over 18 if you're not. Get your parents' permission for this. And you do have to be within the United States to win. So good luck to all of you guys entering. 
So if you use um, my name, Mega, and the number 3 as your discount code, you will get $110 off your next um, Magic Wand or Titan 3 purchase, which is just awesome because that ends up becoming a lot cheaper than most wands that are as off as high quality as these are. So good luck to all of you guys entering. If you guys want to buy this, this is a great deal. You're not going to get it again. And this offer will be valid for about a month. So good luck and thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see how I got this hair, then just keep watching. I'm going to go ahead and just clip up some sections of hair because I have so many layers. So I don't even really do this in a structured process or anything. I just clip up the top section. Okay. And now we have just the bottom layers that are pretty much the same height or the same length except for these front ones. So you're going to go ahead and take this. There is a heat protective glove if you want to use that. Um, you're going to take about... I like one inch sections or so and you're going to just wrap this around being careful not to burn yourself. You want to hold the wand downwards and you're just going to hold for a couple of seconds. I like to hold for about 10. And this is going to be an exercise for your arms. You'll see that in a little bit. So once the sections of hair are done, I like to just leave them down here and kind of just continue. For me, it's really not a neat process, just because I like messy waves best. I just feel like they look really natural, as opposed to really ringlet and really perfect looking waves. If you want like really separate curls, then go ahead and take smaller sections of hair. It just depends on what you like it to look like. I kind of like it to look like voluminous beach waves, like Kardashian curls, things like that. And I also think it makes me look like I have a lot more volume in my hair than I really do. So I like bigger sections. And I find with this wand that my hair stays curly for a really long time. It works just like the Enzo Milano to me. Um, I just, I don't know if this is like a hotter iron than most normal curling irons that, you know, have a clip and whatnot, but these have just worked a lot better on me than normal curling irons do. So I've gotten one side of my hair done. The rest of this is all the other side for the most part. So... I'm going to go ahead and get a section from here. Again, you're going to point your wand downwards. I like to wrap it around, pulling it outwards. I don't want the hair to be an inward curl. I want it to be an outward curl. And you have to take care of that when you are wrapping your hair around the iron. Sorry for my no makeup look. I just always do my hair before I do my makeup, and I prefer that. I wanted to film a makeup video for you guys after this. Depending on how thick your hair is, you're going to decide how long you want each section to be in for. My hair is pretty thick, so I like it to be on for longer. And just because I know it'll last a couple of days. It's really cool. I wash my hair every two days, and this lasts me for a full two days without looking like anything's been done. And if even if it loosens up a little bit, it's like a really pretty loose curl to where it just looks really natural. So it's a win-win. So I finished this bottom layer of my hair. This is what it looks like. I just went ahead and just ran my fingers through it really quickly just to separate them out. Then what I like to do is I'm going to take this section of hair, pull out my clip from the top, and clip this really high up top where you really don't have too many curls so it doesn't like mess with that. And then once we've got this bottom section of hair down and open, we're going to go ahead and start curling that. Now if you have bangs, this is where it's going to be tricky. The bangs never end up looking perfect. So I found one way to do it, which I really like, and it creates volume. Um, but if you have um, longer bangs, it'll be a lot easier than what it is for shorter bangs. So I'm going to go ahead and just do the bangs area right now. I'm taking a thicker section of hair for here. And I like to wrap it down like this horizontally. That really creates this big... Um, volume type thing right up here by the root and it looks so good. For your bangs you really don't need it to stay up there for much time. So you've got that. I know it doesn't look good right now but it will. 
Now you're just going to go ahead and do the rest of your hair like you would normally. And it's okay for these little parts to fall down like this. I just think that that looks more natural instead of having everything look so perfect. I think what I really like about the wand is that you get very natural looking curls as opposed to looking perfect and like red carpet ready or whatever. It's messier and I think sexier than what a curling iron can do for you. Okay, so now that we've got this section all done, we're going to go ahead and take down all of our hair. We start brushing it out. And you will see just how gorgeous it looks. See? So we've got all of it taken down. And I know that it looks really curly right now, but it is something that will become less curly as time goes on. And then because of this being so curly, what I kind of like is that one, it gives you a little bit of volume up here, but also you can kind of pull your hair back and you're still going to have volume as opposed to not having any. For me, like when I'm at working and stuff like that, I like to just pin this to the side or pin this upward just so my bangs don't get in my face. And I think it looks a lot better once you have volume up there. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you found it helpful. I know you guys have been wanting to see a hair tutorial for the longest time for me, so I hope this helped and if you guys have any questions or comments post down below and I'll be sure to, to get back to you guys. Bye!